you know what you're getting with that song. Hello there, it is I, the Geordie Nerd, and I am back again with another episode of Bob's Burgers, Season 3, Episode 11. Forgive me, I am absolutely knackered, you can probably tell, because um, if we just move this along a little bit, my eyes look like Bob's Burgers' eyes. I'm sick of my life, it's been a week, I'm tired, and I could use like a thousand hugs and pictures of pets and stuff. <laughs> um, but yeah, if, you, if you'd like... <coughs> Sorry, if you'd like to see the full unedited reaction, the link is down below for the Patreon and all my other social media links. Um, yeah, let's just get this now and have some fun. 165. Hot Patty. It's safe. Damn it! Yay! Yay! Great A ground beef, meaning we dropped it on the ground. Louise, <laughs> are we done here, Hugo? Almost. There's just the little matter of your hand-washing certification. I don't see it prominently displayed anywhere. Come on, nobody needs to be certified in hand-washing. Yeah! Hands off my hands, government! Yeah, government. Come on, Hugo. And here's your C rating. Which will remain in your window until you graduate. <laughs> what? Hugo, you're an awful man. Uh, wrong, Bob. I'm a lawful man. Cook has dirty, stinky hands. Bob, you've disappointed what all. Naked. That's how the vendor served food in the Bible. Don't drag religion into this. Sorry. So long, Bob. Get certified or that C will stand for closed. <laughs> now, hold on. You said something about nude beach. You have my attention. <laughs> Nude beaches are full of overweight, out of shape, old bodies, and I don't want to go there and realize I look exactly like that. Oh. <laughs> yeah, same. I mean, I'd go. I'd go, but I mean, I'd be disgusted in myself. It's like we're in Paris. I love it. I know. Say la vie. Let's go. <sighs> I just knew, I knew Bob's wife was a bit of a, you know, a risky lady. <laughs> My kind of lady, show me the boobies. <laughs> Hugo's not our health inspector anymore? Do you know what this means? Huh? We're free! No more surprise inspections! No more stupid violations! And I am not going to the hand washing class! Filth! <laughs> filth! Yeah, what's wrong with being filth? I mean, in the, you know, other sense, not the don't wash your hands sense. Wash your hands. I... The old Hugo would have seen this man as a health hazard, pure and simple. The new Hugo sees only a man. A nude man selling blondies. Three blondies, please. Whoa, wait. Wha wait, where'd you pull that from? My fanny pack. <laughs> Where's your fanny pack? <laughs> oh, there it is. Well, it kind of makes... Oh, Christ, yeah. So funny in the UK means something totally different. I don't know why I'm putting on the posh voice, because I'm probably uncomfortable. But it means vagina. So you're walking around with a vagina, but then again, we call them bum bags. So, yeah, what's worse? Bums have poo in them. <laughs> Fuck off, Paul. I can't stand inspectors like that. You know, it makes us look like turds. No one could make you look like a turd without your permission. Eleanor Roosevelt. Ha! This kid's a trip. <laughs> funny stuff. Funny stuff. You know... Yeah, I'm pretty sure I should have said that. Oh, God, my eyes, man. They're so puffy. Christ, do apologize. I am really tired. Paul and Brew, you should come by. That, that'd be great. Absolutely. What your burger did to my mouth, my music is going to do to your ears. That's great. <laughs> <laughs> give me a... <here>, <laughs> I prefer the old inspector, to be honest, because he didn't ask him to do stuff. And I'm like, yeah, but if that was me and somebody asked me to do something, and I'd, I'd just be like, no, I, I don't want to do things, please. I just want to cry and sleep. Preferably sleep while crying, because then I wouldn't be awake when I was crying. I don't know. Don't be shy. They certainly aren't. Hello, Louise. Daryl, you interested? You strike me as more of an indoor nerd. I am interested, but not as a customer, as a key member of your team. For I mean, as a teenage boy, obviously, I was obsessed with boobs because I was a teenage... Well, I was obsessed with everything to do with that kind of thing because I was a teenage boy. And uh, nothing has changed. <laughs> I leave my shirt on, that's okay. Don't make me feel self-conscious, babe. Sex, 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 sex. When you're done, say that was fun. We might have made a little sun. I'm good at sex, you're bad at sex. 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 I'm I knew Tina would love the song, like, to be fair. And I mean, I do too. I, it's, 
It's just, it's, you know what you're getting with that song. Woo! Man, what people don't know about rock, it's a very physical experience. You know, yeah, it's, it's, it's very athletic. You're moving around a lot. Yeah, yeah, you notice that. It's almost, I mean, I'm, obviously I'm not a rock star. I've got guitars, I can play guitars, but never have I once played a song that says I'm good at sex, you're bad at sex. Not once. I mean, and I've made my own songs. And none of them have got anything to do with sex, more depression. <laughs> I'm good at depression, you're bad at depression! Only a dollar to get a closer look at the action. Step right up! Look through this tube, see some boob. Give me the green, see some peen. <laughs> I mean, I knew he was gonna rhyme green with peen. Still funny though, really funny. Cause I'm a child. Then he wiped our record clean. <laughs> my enemy, my enemy. You are my enemy, my enemy. No, no, it's my just me, enemy. just me, just me, just me, my oh, enemy. Sorry. I mean, I resonate more with that one, to be fair, than I did the I'm good at sex, you're bad at sex song, but still, terrible, terrible. Nude Cathalon. That sounds like the Cathalon, but nude. They're naked and old and they're bringing home the gold. I mean, yeah, let's go for it. Who doesn't want to see boobs and peen flapping about in the wind going really fast? And it's a shame about that guy. You know, he got shut down by me. What are you doing? You know, I hate to say this, but you know, you got rat turds on your floor, man. And I, you know, I got to write that up, unfortunately. What? Tommy, that's crazy. You just carry around bags of rat turds in your pocket? <laughs> yeah, I don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, look over. See, I see some more right over here. See? You didn't even empty that one. You're saying a rat just came in here and tossed a bag of its poop on my floor? Yeah. Yeah, definitely. I've seen them do it. I've seen them do it. Let them please. Terrible rock in your in your restaurant. What's going on here anyway? Naked field day. Fun. Bubbla bubbla. There he is. I can't believe I'm gonna grovel to a naked Hugo. I mean, I love how everything's strategically placed so you can't see any peen. Now I don't know what that says about me personally, but still. <laughs> This is what it takes. This is what it takes. Bob, you do realize what you're getting yourself into. A nude Cathalon has 27 events, not including warm-up freeze tag. I quit. No, Bobby, <laughs> come on, you can do it. Come on, Bob, we can do it. <laughs> ah! We played with fire and this is what we get. Fire in our eyes. I think Dad looks pretty good considering he's had three kids. Hey, Dad, <laughs> stop stretching like that. Oh, my God. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, Bob just carried those kids to term. He's, it's, it's, it's a parent's body. <laughs> Bob is hairy, man. Real hairy. You're my big naked knife. I'm dying. Gentlemen, enter the ring. I mean, obviously, I don't want to see it. But in that position, you would. So where is it? What's going on? The closing ceremony, Bob. Remember? You have to cater it. Disrobe at will. Don't bother with courtesy tissues on the seats. Get nude for food. I love it. Hold the buns, am I right? Well, now if that was something that I could do, get nude for food, it's like OnlyFans, but instead of money, I get food, I'd probably do it. Well, um, yeah. So he changed his song up a little bit. Everybody's good at sex now, and the song sounded a little bit better, so... Progress for everyone, I suppose. Uh, Bob's back open, of course he is. We didn't see any wangs or boobies, though, so I'm giving this a 1 out of 10. No, it was a funny episode, as they all are, to be honest. Um, yeah, sorry, the start of the video was a bit uh, depressing, wasn't it? Like, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I mean, I'm always honest, aren't I? So uh, that's, that's me. Um, thank you for your support. I really do appreciate it. Hopefully that, um, that guy comes back again, the other food hygiene majigga thing <laughs> i need sleep but yeah um yeah hopefully he comes back and uh thank you as ever for watching i'll see you all again very soon for more bob's burgers reaction videos